Hello everyone, this is Shadow Mario 41. Welcome to my next Let's Play, which is actually a replay of a game that I did previously when I only had a camera and tripod. This is Donkey Kong Country 2 Diddy's Conquest for the Super Nintendo, released in 1995. This is a sequel to Donkey Kong Country 1, and probably one of the greatest video game sequels to an already great game. So obviously there's no save data. I'm actually using the Virtual Console version of this game, not the Super Nintendo cartridge. We're gonna go File 2 just to be different. Because um, with my Super Nintendo cartridge, if you watched my previous Let's Play of this game, you know that that was on its last leg. Like, it was having save malfunctions and, you know, graphic glitches and sound glitches and I just wanted to be safe and go with the Virtual Console version. Plus, we can sort of compare the two as well, so. Anyway, I'm gonna be doing one player since I'm going solo. But just to explain the other game modes, two player team, one player controls Diddy and one player controls Dixie. And then two player contest, you have two sets of Diddy and Dixie. One player controls one and the other player controls the other. And you pretty much just race to see who can beat the game first or any other condition that you guys set. But we're going to be doing the good old one player mode. Thumbs up Diddy Kong, let's go. So this is the first world, wow what a menacing overworld map. Definitely a big change from Donkey Kong Country which had a very happy, you know, happy-go-lucky sort of theme in the overworld. This is very menacing. So let's start out with level one, Pirate Panic. So I'd like to know what's going on. What's in here? There's no backstory, really. Oh, a map. Ooh, let's see. I've kidnapped that lumbering fool, Donkey Kong, and you'll never see him again. Ar har 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 har. Captain K. Rule. So Donkey Kong's actually been kidnapped, and it's up to Dick Diddy Kong and his girlfriend, who we're going to free in a minute, Dixie Kong, to save Donkey Kong and ultimately save DK Isle from King K. Rule, or Captain K. Rule this time around. And of course, this, this game, if you haven't noticed already, is pirate themed, which makes it automatically awesome. So, there you go, how about that? Get that little secret there to get a... and already get hit by like the third enemy in the game. No problem though. I hate these stupid mice. Or rats. Anyway, uh, that maneuver that I did before and that I'll have to do again is a team up move. You press the A button to do that. The controls are actually the same on the Virtual Console Classic Controller that they are on the uh, original um, Super NES. So you don't have to worry about control adjustments really. Down here we find our first bonus stage. We also got KON, Con. If we get KONG, we get a free life, just like the original game. And this is a pathetically easy bonus level. First, you can go over there to find a banana coin. All you have to do is climb up these barrels, and there you go, creme coin. Creme coins will be used for something that I'm going to explain later. But we want to get as many of them as we can. We actually want to get all of them. But uh, if you don't plan on doing 100%, just still try to get as many as you can. Anyway, we now have Rambi the Rhinoceros, the most badass animal buddy from the original, makes a return in the first level. And we can use his special ability this time. All animal buddies have special abilities this time around to bust down the wall and access another bonus stage. Destroy them all. Oh, we have Rambi in this one. These guys don't stand a chance. Look at this. This is pathetic. How can you stop a bouncing rhinoceros? You can't. You can't stop that. You can't control it. You can only hope to contain him. Okay, so up here we can actually find this giant coin with DK on it. That's a hero coin. <laughs> now if you've watched my previous Let's Play of this game, you know that I had some trouble with hero coins in the later levels. But even still in the earlier levels, which was kind of embarrassing. But we're going to try and remedy that this time around. Not going to have the same issues as we had last time. But that's it for the first level. Very simple, very straightforward, and actually a very good way to get free lives if you're a little low. Let me just explain that when you clear a level, if it has an exclamation mark next to it, that means you found all the bonus levels, found and completed all the bonus levels. And if it has a DK insignia, that means you got the hero coin. Now we're going to go to the second level, Main Brace Mayhem. And we have a click clack here. We can defeat them by rolling into them or jump on them twice. Uh, now, let me explain the differences between Diddy and Dixie. I find Diddy to be overall faster, a little more agile, better with rolls. You can do a special ability called a roll jump, where you roll and jump, uh, like sort of like a double jump type of thing. 
but Dixie is a little slower but has her hair twirl ability or helicopter spin, I guess as it's called in Donkey Kong 64 when you can do it with Tiny Kong, that allows her to fly or glide over gaps like that. And that's how we access this bonus stage. Very nice, very nice. So this is a very easy find the token bonus stage. There are actually three types of bonus stages. We haven't seen the third type yet, but we will in this level. Find the token, destroy them all, and collect the stars. Find the token, you just have to find the token. Very self-explanatory. Destroy them all, you have to destroy all the enemies without getting hit. And the last last but not least, um, what was it? Collect the stars. Just have to get all the stars. So while I'm just climbing up ropes, doing nothing really in particular, I just want to say that's a pretty big day for Crystal Star Studio today. I mean, we have three projects starting on the same day. This one and two others. One by Mega Freak 400 and one by Slim Kirby. Not quite sure what they're doing, to be honest. So it'll be interesting to find out. And also today's my birthday, so... My 19th birthday, so I decided to reward myself by playing this game. I actually am playing it on my birthday. Like, on today. On Sunday, the 16th. So that's pretty exciting. Go up here, grab two free lives from that lovely green balloon. And get this crate and try to chuck it at this guy. Let's do that. So yeah, check out Slim Kirby and Mega Freak 400's videos today. I will have it in the... Uh, I'll have a link in the video description, or we'll do, like, video response or something, but they'll be there. It'll just be pretty cool to see what we all had in mind to start on May 16th. Now, let's destroy them all. By the way, if you get a cannon, cannonball to the cannon like I, like I just did, um, you access a bonus level. That's how you access some of the bonus levels. Um, that could be a lot harder than it just was, because um, a lot of times you have to take the cannon off tri over like treacherous gaps and stuff and it's easier to drop it and lose it so you have to be extra careful with that in this let's play we're also going to try to collect the letters k-o-n-g in every level it's completely unnecessary i mean it's a nice little extra free life but if i can't collect them if something comes up where i can't collect them like you need a certain animal buddy or something and i don't have that i'll point out where they are at least Anyway, here's Collect the Stars, the final bonus stage type. You just have to collect the stars. Collect the number of stars in the top left-hand corner, getting my lefts and rights mixed up. Um, usually you have to collect all of them, but a lot of times, or sometimes you don't. Sometimes you just have to collect a certain amount of them. But most, you know, most of the time it's uh, all of them. So... We're about done with this level, but don't forget the hero coin right there. I will not be forgetting that. And drop down and get a free life. How nice. So that's two levels down. And we're going to try and do the third one in this video. You might have seen Cranky Kong's icon up at the top above Main Brace Mayhem, but I'll go over that later. I'll go over that in the next video. I just want to get through the first three levels here. First we have a find the token bonus stage. Pretty much just in one of these chests. I mean, you have plenty of time on the clock to open all four of them, and of course it's in the last one. So, that's pretty easy. Now, red zingers, as you saw, cannot be destroyed by projectiles. They're pretty much invincible flying machines, so you just gotta dodge them. I mean, in that instance, you actually it actually helped you because you used it to open up all the treasure chests. And we have some kaboings here. Kaboings have two peg legs for whatever reason. These are clomps. Clomps only have one. Two peg legs seems kind of, I don't know, counterproductive. <laughs> oh, got a free life there. Very nice. Team up to get up to that barrel. And grab some bananas and the O. Oh, and get hit by a guy. Checkpoint. Banana coin. Alright, these guys up here, I don't remember what they're called, but... You have to watch out for them. You can only kill them with barrels. You cannot kill them or other projectiles like chests, crates, and stuff. You cannot jump on them. If you jump on them, they get really mad and they start going on a rampage. And if you hit them again, you will uh, lose a con. This barrel gives you invincibility, so we're going to take advantage of that. Get the G there. 
grab all the stuff on the way, jump up here, and get a bonus stage. You gotta be kinda quick with that though, because it does run out if you're not fast enough. And we're gonna switch to Dixie for this bonus stage. I mean, it's not really that hard. I actually, I think I failed this in my previous LP, but this time around, we succeed. Because if, if at first you don't succeed, then try, try again, of course. And we're, we're done with this level. Grab a free life. Had to wait for the uh, little thing to switch to a free life there. But we have 20 free lives already. I mean, you might think that this is a little easy, but trust me, it'll get really hard really fast. So that's it for this first video of Let's Play, um, sorry I coughed, uh, Let's Play uh, Donkey Kong Country 2 Diddy's Conquest. See you guys next time when we cover Lockjaw's Locker and these other little icons on the map. Ciao.